Oxford U.S. theaters were open for the first wide release since theaters shuttered in March. It was for Unhinged, starring, starring Russell Crowe from Independent Solstice Studios. It sold some $4 million in domestic ticket sales, according to Comscore. Now, pre-COVID, that would have been a disappointment, but now it indicates demand. We talked to a woman in Orlando inside a theater about what movie going is like right now. Even before you walk in the front door, the signage is, is very noticeable. There's an individual behind a plexiglass partition to take your ticket wearing a mask. I booked my tickets online and I also pre-ordered concessions online. When I arrived, they handed me concessions in a gift bag type setup. The cups came in the bag as well and it, the cups were uh, like self-serve cups. Refills temporarily unavailable. It felt very vacant. I, like ghost town like so far i've seen four people during the movie after the movie before the movie i felt safe and it was clean now, seven states, including California and New York, those seven typically account for about a quarter of box office revenue. They're still not allowed to open theaters. So, Kelly, it'll be interesting to see what happens when those states start showing releases as well. You know, that popcorn looks so good right now, Julia, but I, I just don't, I'm not ready.